guys, it's Danica back with another process video. This time I'm going to be going back to week 32 and just kind of showing you what I'm going to be using here. This is the Project 52 core kit and the specialty cards. Uh, so you can see that one that's kind of that zigzaggy chevroni is has some gold detail on it. Um, I'm also going to be using the brand new Close to My Heart embellishments. Uh, these are part of what they call fundamentals. Um, I don't know if many of you know, but I am a Close to My Heart consultant. Um, and so I got to get some of these products early and kind of play with them. So um, they will be available to order today. I'll leave a link in the description box to my shop um, or you can always use the search feature on the Close to My Heart website and find a consultant in your area because a lot of them do uh, crops and events and classes and things like that. Um, so yeah, so these are some glittery kind of foam stickers and they come in triangles, circles, hearts, and stars. And these are the bows that I kind of hinted at. I think I had a picture on the Project Life Obsessed page a little sneak peek and then these that I'm opening are the wood veneer and they are, have kind of like a gold embossing on them <clears throat> excuse me and then there are the little clips so you get the glitter stickers the bows the wood veneer and the clips and those are $9.95 and they come in eight different colors so um, my favorite is the gold, of course, <laughs> but you know, that's just my opinion. So here, these are the fundamental sticker packs. They come in four different types. they are different color sets. This is the, uh, the basics, which is the gold, black, brown, gray. Uh, so you get the word stickers and these are just some kind of generic fun, kind of fun stickers. Uh, there's some alphas, uh, black, gold, and white and then the arrows and labels. So four sheets of stickers, and those are just $6.95 for four sheets of stickers. So I think they're a great deal and a lot of fun. So again, the link will be down below in the description box if you wanna check those out, they're available today. So now I'm just kind of showing you some of the things I'm gonna be using. I picked up some uh, little puffy stickers at Tuesday morning, and then I got the uh, DIY craft tags that I'm using on my title card. I bought those um, from Paper Issues. And then these are the, well not these that I have in my hand, I, I pulled out the Heidi Swap stickers. Uh, so while I'm working on my title card I wanted to give you my special announcement that we hit 100 subscribers. I'm very excited about that. And actually, I think as of this recording, I had about 107 subscribers. So thank you for sharing and watching and recommending me to your friends. And uh, just to kind of celebrate that, I wanted to do a giveaway. So um, not only do we have the fundamental, like the assortment that I had there uh, or the stickers, but we also have some overlays um, and several new what are called picture my life card sets they're a lot like their project life card sets but of course we can't call them project life so they're called picture my life um, so we've got some new card sets as well but what I want to do for hitting my hundred subscribers is I want to give you guys uh, a chance to win some of the fundamentals so I'm going to be giving away the fundamentals assortment a fundamental sticker pack and a pack of overlays. They come in both three by four and four by six in one pack. And so, um, and those you can choose your colors and things like that. So whoever wins, I'll have you go to the Close to My Heart website to go look at those in the catalog and choose your colors. So that's my announcement. I'm super excited. Uh, the way you enter is to comment on this video. And on Friday, I will come back. I will gather up all the comments, put names into a jar, and I'll do a little video uh, Friday evening of me drawing the name of the person who wins. So you'll want to come back on Friday for that. So what I'm doing is just using all these embellishments. These are, um, obviously I have the 
the glittery stickers there. And I don't know if I said, I can't remember if I said that each of the shapes comes in three different sizes. So kind of a small, medium, large, which is a lot of fun for little clusters of embellishments and things like that. And then these little puffies I'm using are from Craft Market and I got those at Tuesday morning a couple of weeks ago. So just kind of deciding I wanted to change the uh, where I had some of those cards and then these stickers oh my goodness they gave me fits usually when you get stickers like this they uh, like have the little peely part that is kind of sticky I don't know and that's how you get the stickers out but those Heidi Swap stickers did not and it was really really annoying so I start to pull them apart and then I realized there's really no way to get them open other than to cut them. And the sticker sheet itself is like really close to the edge of the plastic. So anyway, I totally should have opened those before I started recording. But I didn't realize they were going to be so difficult. And of course the gold ones are the same way. So I got these word stickers. Uh, I don't know if they're an exclusive to Michael's or not, but that's where I purchased them. They're brand new and I peel this off and I did not realize that these were actually slightly transparent so I'm just going to use one of my trusty vellum circles and cut to cover up that word agenda it doesn't quite cover it up so I decide to take another vellum circle and just layer it on top of there again and that was adequate to cover up the word it says agenda and um, it really wasn't an agenda. I just wanted to use that pink as my journaling card. So I put all those little stickers on the left hand side there because they had the little uh, the little colons like the two dots in between a time. Uh, I think you were supposed to, the card was meant for you to write in a time and what you did uh, on each of those lines. And so I just covered those up using the little stickers, uh, the puppy stickers and the close to my heart ones so i have i'm just adding a few things uh, from my lazy susan over there i had those little tickets that i wanted to put on because we were at the fair this page is just my monday pictures um, everything from the fair and i was also refinishing a hutch for my craft room so just going to embellish these uh, some of these little embellishments are just things that I had in my stash uh, some of you have asked about my lazy Susan I picked that up at Goodwill and kind of in the kitchenware section they had lots of different ones actually but this one was the biggest one by far and it was only ten dollars so and I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna paint that wood base white to kind of go better with my my craft room but the top of my table is the same color really it's the same almost the exact same table that I'm actually scrapping on now it's just a counter height table so yeah so there I opened those stickers I stopped the video this time um, so kind of figuring out what else I want to add to these uh, pictures those um, uh, pictures at the bottom I use the pick frame app to collage a bunch of the pictures from the fair um, I did the same thing with the smaller pictures in the middle I made uh, I put four of those onto a four by six and so I can get a bunch of little pictures instead of the bigger three by fours just adding some uh, tags for journaling and things like that although I think I just use this as a place to put the date um, on this picture and I am going to apologize for the glare there until I get set up in my scrap room I don't have a lot of options with the lighting um, if I'm scrapping at night and recording these videos I have to have that overhead light on uh, my side light doesn't really do enough and so I can't really point that in any other direction uh, my lights in my new scrap room I can they're kind of like a track lighting and so I can move them however I want depending on whether I'm just scrapping or whether I'm recording a video so that will be nice I'm looking forward to that so a couple more weeks and I should be good to go so here I have a little insert with some more pictures from the fair um, what's crazy is I didn't even bring my DSLR to the fair this night I 
I tend to go crazy taking pictures when I have my DSLR, so I thought for sure that would keep me from taking so many pictures, but apparently not. Anyway, so there's one of those overlays. Those are from Close to My Heart. Um, they come in, in like, I think it's a gold and silver, or there's a black. Yeah, there's so there's a gold and silver pack. You get 12 4x6 and 12 3x4. They're all different. And then there's the black, which also has uh, some silver with it. And again, 12 4x6 and 12 3x4. And those are $10 for the 24 overlays. So really some cute designs. Um, and I love overlays. They just Sometimes I just don't take the time to import my photo into an app and write something on it. Or, um, you know, I just want to do something different. And so that's an easy way to add just a little bit to your photos. So kind of going through my stash here, I have some bits and pieces from the trinkets value kit that I used. And um, I think the other ones were maybe open book, um, some of those pieces of ephemera. So just adding some journaling. I do end up adding some more to this card here uh, at the end. And um, now I'm just going to play around with this bottom yellow card. I kind of changed my mind on where I wanted some things and I play around with this feather for forever and I just can't get it to go the way I like it. I've seen other people use these feathers from the trinkets kit and they turn out cute and I just can't seem to get it the way I like it. So I got that little Ferris wheel from, it, it was part of the Studio Calico July kit. I no longer subscribe to Studio Calico but I was able to pick those up in the Project Life Shop and Swap. Um, kind of a good way that if there's some things you like about some kits but you don't want to make a commitment, you can, a lot of people are selling things in that group, so, uh, from those kits. So, that's what I did. Um, so I go and I add some things here and I'm going to apologize right now because I, the bad thing about recording on my phone is if I forget to basically turn my phone off so it's like on do not disturb, if I get a phone call and someone leaves a voicemail, my video stops recording. So I didn't realize because I had my phone on silent, I didn't realize that I'd gotten a phone call and a voicemail and that the video had stopped recording and I just kept scrapping for another 10 minutes or so. So it will cut short a little bit here, but then I went back and did a close-up of each card and I actually wasn't even quite done at that point. I We were at the fair with some of my husband's co-workers who were here from India. He leads a team over in India but he works here um, and I was unsure of the spelling of their names and I wanted to get them right in the scrapbook so I had to go look those up on Facebook to make sure I had the spelling right. So you'll see some blanks in my journaling uh, where I didn't put their names um, and I should have just gone with my instinct on what how they were spelled because I, I had them right <laughs> but that's okay so I'm using these um, L studio and I say L I hear other people say Ellie but Ellie to me is E L L I E because that's my daughter's name but I don't know maybe it is Ellie studio but I say L studio uh, these were part of one of the take 10 kits I think it was uh, the June kit so I'm just spelling out a title here a Ferris wheel selfie so I don't take selfies very often but I do every once in a while I try to at least like once a week get at least a picture of me in the weekly scrapbook so I'm just peeling off that cling on the back of those uh, overlays so that is something if you didn't know that most overlays have some sort of little plastic protectant on them and yeah there goes my video <laughs> So anyway, make sure you take that plastic protect enough. Here's the close-up of the cards here. Again, you'll see in the stills that I add something to that one. And I do add in Sunny's name on there. Um, so here's the one with the overlay. I added a few little embellishments to that bottom part. And that's about it. So don't forget to leave me a comment so that you are entered to win. And thank you so much for watching.